what you're saying, Mike? Uh, Kevin Samuels. Oh, yeah, the, the male advocate. Yeah, I that, get that had a heart attack when he was at a one night stand, but he gonna tell everybody else how to have a relationship. <laughs> I'm gonna thank you, how I live with him. Look, Boogie said he got it. <laughs> He got what? He got it. He wanted to see why you don't think too highly of him. Well, because I feel like he ain't practice what he preach. I feel like you can't sit here and tell women they should not let men treat them a certain way and you wanted the men to treat women a certain way. That's kind of how I saw it. I felt like a lot of things that he was saying, it was pretty good and interesting. It was good advice. Don't get me wrong. But then you part of the problem. Mm. Does that make sense? Like, you you want to sit here and say women should, you know, have more respect and they should do this and, you know, all that kind of stuff, but yet you engaging in a one-night stand. How is that helping to put women in a better position? You know, some of the stuff I agree with, some of the stuff I don't, but that's how I am with some of everybody. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Because, you know, ain't nobody perfect, so everybody got their own opinion or whatever. I just, you know, I felt like some of the stuff was pretty good to, you know, but at the end of the day, I don't, like, let me give you an example. Like, if a man and a woman, to get, not together, but they, let's say they like friends, but they sleeping together, right? Mm-hmm. And the man say, you know, I don't want to be with you like that. And the woman like, okay, I understand you don't want to be with me like that, meaning you don't want to go beyond a booty call. But Mm. then the woman, her feelings involved. That's a natural Mm. thing, right? If you're sleeping with a woman, her feelings involved. Mm. Whether you tell her straight up and down you don't want to be in a relationship or not, it ain't too many women that's built to be able to say, oh, okay, well, that's fine, shit. Do what you're going to do, I'm going to do what I'm going to do. If she's fucking with just you, so then the next thing you know, he say, yeah, this one came over here, bust my windows out. I was over here with another girl. She done damn, you know, flat my tires and shit. Mm-hmm. Why would you not expect her to do that just because you told her that you don't want to be in a relationship, but you still sleeping with her? If you don't want to be with her, don't sleep with her. That's my biggest problem with men. Oh, I don't like her like that. I don't we just friends. Nah, she ain't my girlfriend. We just hooking up every now and then. What the fuck? Why? No, oh, hold, 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 hold. on, yeah. hold on. Just as well, she's sleeping with him. So where where is her blame at to this? And why that the only way that she can handle herself when she get mad, she got to bust a window. I'm not saying oh, that's appropriate oh, or anything like that. She I'm giving you a scenario. I she's know a, you gave yeah. me some scenarios, but she's she, right. you she give me the common that. ones that he talking about. You he give me the same right. ones that he that's, talking about. That's true. But I mean, it's a massive majority of y'all fools running around here doing that silly ass shit, costing you money and that person money. Shit. Yeah, no, no, no. I'm just using it as an example, but what I'm not saying it's okay for her to do that. It could be even anything. It, she don't have to get to that extreme. That was a bit extreme. It could just be, you know, the fact that she constantly saying, let's be together, or I want to be with you, or she caught up with all her feelings, you know, and things like that, you know, but, and you are right. If the man says, look, I don't want to be with you like that. I just want to fuck around, blah, blah, blah. If you're a woman and you know what you want, then no, you shouldn't settle for that. But a lot of times the women be like, okay, well, I'm just going to get what I can get from now. And maybe I'm going to, you know, do something. So I think it's wrong on both parts. But my thing. No, no, no. It's not wrong on both parts. It's, it's wrong on the woman part. Ain't nobody tell you to think that way. Hold on. Listen, too. listen, listen. Why? Why do you have to think that way? It's it's so many other ways that you could think about this situation, but you one track minded with the blinders on that is this and this and this. Who, like the, the girl who in the relationship or me? No, it's just the girl that's in the, we talking in general as the girl in the relationship, yeah, we talking right. about society mm-hmm. as the things that he talking about. Well, that's a mass group like of people. What? That's a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? It's like for real right now, you don't have to entertain nothing. You can block somebody. Just cut the shit off. You ain't even got to change your number no more. But what if you really like this person? And you know, and you know, I mean, 
I'm yeah. just saying. Yeah. I feel like a lot of time the men. The, my point is when we talk about whatever this man name is, Kevin, Kevin Samuels or whatever. Yeah. When he want to see her and act like the women this and a woman that, to me, a lot of times it be the men who don't be taking no responsibility for some of the shit that they be doing that damage women over time. 